Well, hello there. Happy day before Thanksgiving. Anyway, that's the day it is for me right now. That's probably not gonna be the day it is for you. It's probably gonna be a few days after. I hope you had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I'm really excited about mine. That is yet to happen, but I have a lot to do in preparation for tomorrow. I haven't grabbed the camera and done like a solo vlog in a while. And I don't know how solo this will be. I'm gonna just kind of vlog my Thanksgiving prep leading up to our Thanksgiving day. I thought that would be fun and different uh, on our end anyway, different for us. Okay, first things first, <laughs> there might still be happy birthday banner above me. <laughs> I'm just not ready to stop celebrating yet. I'm going to write all that I'm cooking and preparing and just bringing for tomorrow because I've been a little scatterbrained lately and so I think it's gonna help me to have it up on the board. All right, things to do slash bring. First off, we have a green bean casserole. You don't like that, Roland? Oh. Second, we're doing broccoli salad. Then we're gonna attempt a, a vegan mac and cheese. And last but not least, deviled eggs. Dun, dun, dun. We also have rolls, gluten-free rolls that we need to bring with us tomorrow. I am not cooking those though. <laughs> it looks intimidating, <laughs> but I'm not too worried about it. Green bean casserole, I'm pretty much gonna prep tonight. Deviled eggs I'm going to do here in a minute. Um, vegan mac and cheese may wait till in the morning. Broccoli salad's gonna get done the night too. I'm confident that I'm not gonna be rushed tomorrow or stressed. No stress. That's my goal. All right, I'm going to let this boil while they're boiling. And we're gonna snap some green beans. So delicious looking. Minus that one roll in here. And they're gonna be cooked, it's fine. <laughs> my green bean casserole is Paleo, and it came from this wonderful cookbook. Ah, oh, Danielle Walker, she's a genius. I own all of her cookbooks because they're so ah oh, wonderful. This book is really neat too because it has like different holidays and family get-togethers and just recipes from that. So green bean casserole with crispy shallots, shallots, shallots. So from the picture, that it looks delicious. And I, I'm having a hard time remember, but I, remembering, but I think I made this last year, and I think I really loved it. Here's hoping this was the recipe. I have some food marks here, and um, that's a telltale sign <laughs> that I've used this recipe before. So I'm gonna go ahead and say that this was the recipe I used last year. And if so, I, I loved it. I thought it was delicious. On to snapping some green beans. And you can tell it's not as light outside. The eggs are boiled and peeled and cut. They don't look super pretty, but you know what? It doesn't matter. <laughs> and then I have the middle all ready to go. I'm probably just gonna do this part in the morning. The hardest part is already done. Does anyone actually like peeling boiled eggs? Somebody told me a faster way to do it. And it's, it is faster. But I still, it is so tedious. <laughs> so this is almost done. Probably just one more step and the double eggs are finished. Thank you for well, chopping that. that. You're doing such a great job. Look at that. Is that a good size? Should I cut more on that? Maybe a little bit um, more? Maybe just a little bit more, but that's it's just about done. I'm impressed. Cool. My broccoli's already been washed and I'm gonna cut it next. But we also have to, we're about to eat dinner. So I'm about to grill some um, chicken. So we're gonna take a, a prep break for Din Din. <laughs> what happened? <laughs> Yeah, really. I am uh, getting this pan out. It's really tiring. Trying to sit. You just laid down. I'm just kind of plot down here. Okay. It's just a lot of work. Cooking, 
you know, growing alive. <laughs> I was just sitting here still chopping my onion and I just have been talking to her for five minutes. I didn't realize she was <laughs> in the floor behind me. You just stay on there. I'll give me the pen. I'll take I'll take care of dinner. Here you go. Yeah. Cool. I got this. <laughs> dinner is long time finished. So is our broccoli salad. But then it looks scrumptious. It'll be more visually appealing tomorrow when I transfer it to the prettier bowl. And my broccoli salad recipe comes from cookeatpaleo.com. So if you're in the mood for a healthier-ish broccoli salad, check it out. I think it's delicious. I've been using this recipe for three years now, I think. I don't know. I did not get started really on the green bean casserole like I planned. The vegetables are all prepped and ready to go. You know, it'll be an easier transition tomorrow morning. I just didn't get it ready to just throw in the oven like I wanted. But you know what? That's okay. Things happen. I would really just like to go sit down. So that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> Baby's tired. Anna's tired. I think that's fair. That's fair. What are your plans for the rest of the evening, sir? I actually have a little bit of work that I have to do for a few clients. Yeah. But... So you don't have to work tomorrow. I don't have do to it work tonight, tomorrow. so you don't have do to do it tomorrow. tomorrow. Tonight, yep. so I have to do it tomorrow. Uh, but I also have some plans to at least start putting pieces together or finding pieces to announce to the world about Baby Anderson. Oh. Because as of this moment, I don't know if you've covered this, no, no one knows. I no one knows. <laughs> I'm sorry. No one knows that Baby Anderson is in there. Well, well actually, family and then family and a lot some of close friends. friends. Yeah. Yes, they, they've known for a few weeks now, but the rest of the world know. doesn't know that I'm almost that I'm almost 15 weeks pregnant. Yeah, I can't believe it. Isn't that shocking? It is shocking. And so exciting. We're going to talk a lot more gonna, about You're going to hear this. about it. Okay, vegetables prepped. Tomorrow morning will consist of the vegan mac and cheese and the green bean casserole. But I am glad that I got the broccoli salad out of the way. So that's good. Good morning. Happy Thanksgiving. The green bean casserole is well on its way. Can't see it because of the sun glare, but it's in there, I promise. I'm about to start on the mac and cheese, the vegan mac and cheese. And then I have to put together the deviled eggs and I think we're good to go. I had a slower start this morning because the smell of the cooking sherry didn't bode well for me. I got a little sick to my stomach, didn't throw up, but I had to leave the room and all the windows are like open even though it's 35 degrees outside. <laughs> it was really intense. So <laughs> I even had to like sit down for a minute because I was lightheaded, but I'm, I'm good now. I'm on the right track, I think, Lord willing. About to finish up mac and cheese. Time's ticket. I think we have like an hour before we need to be out the door. So we'll see, we'll see if it all gets done. Okay. With the exception of these two, I didn't have a hand in these two, just picking them up. <laughs> I think everything is ready. It all looks decent. I know this is gonna be good. This is the real mystery. This is my vegan mac and cheese. I have no early idea. Cause the way I was feeling this morning, I couldn't bring myself to try it. It could go either way. If it's horrible, it's not gonna hurt my feelings because it was a completely new recipe that I didn't even taste. <laughs> and then deviled eggs, broccoli salad, we're good to go. I think we are good to go. And this is waiting for Randy when we return. <laughs> I'll help him though, maybe. All right, I'm gonna go grab my makeup back so I can apply my makeup on the way to Coleman. Let's check off our list. You got the green bean casserole. Got it. You got the broccoli salad. Got it. You got the vegan mac and cheese. Got it. You got the deviled eggs. Got it. You got the rolls. Got it. You got the pie. Yep. Oh, excellent. All right. <laughs> Let's do this. I will say really quick, my mom only asked me to bring the broccoli salad and the green bean casserole. Everything else I brought because I wanted it. I Her put appetite's this... been off. She's been looking forward to feasting Sorry. on food. I have. I've been looking forward to this day and I wanted all the foods. That's why I brought so much I didn't have to. <laughs> but it's okay. All right. I'm gonna go grab a mega bag and, and put these in a thing and, and hit the road. Yeah.
And just like that, Thanksgiving is practically all over. It went so fast, <laughs> um, but it was, it was great. It was wonderful. I love my family so much. So anytime I can see them and spend some time with them is just beyond excellent. Food wise, it was all great. So good. Didn't like the vegan mac and cheese. It was probably the blandest thing I've had in a very long time. It wasn't great. It was more of me and less of the actual recipe. I know some of you are like, it was vegan. There was no actual cheese in it. Of course it was bland. But I think I kind of got some of the ingredients mixed up. So I think it was me. If I try this recipe again, I think I know what to change. But I'm not 100% sure I'm going to try it again. I don't know. It was just really disappointing. <laughs> not great. For someone who really wanted mac and cheese, that was a flop. That was such a flop but it's fine. The broccoli salad was good and the green bean casserole was somewhat decent. Didn't taste great heated up, but you know, it's okay. The whole meal was just, it was delicious. And it, like I said, it was really great spending time with family. I'm so thankful for my family. I'm thankful for my parents, for brothers, for sister-in-laws, for nieces and nephews, for my in-laws. So thankful for Randy. Me? Yes, you. That was fairly decent timing, I guess. It was cute. I'm very thankful for you. I'm thankful for you too, boo. I'm blessed to have you in my life. And this year, you know, <laughs> we are very thankful for the baby. So thankful. Sweet baby. Him or her. We actually so overwhelmed. finished up the, the basic main part of the announcement video today and I gotta say guys like I'm I don't know how I'm so excited and it's just so great to like finally get this news out to everyone and we're probably gonna just like say a bunch of things like we've got to film one more part for it like the ending part in the morning and so I'm trying not to use up my words for that because oh, yeah. I'm gonna save it for that but it's just gonna feel great to like tell everyone and include them in the next part of our journey and Lord willing, you know, we have a baby in a few months. Lord willing. We're praying and believing that it's we just will. It's insane. And the fact that we get to tell everyone else and like finally get to share how great this news is and like how excited we are, it's, it's, it's great. It's a... It's great, but it's also very scary. <laughs> it's very scary. <laughs> it's so but it, real. It's also going to make like this holiday season just like such a, an amazing time to remember. I'm also thankful, like I didn't get to finish that before you dropped yeah, in. Yeah, finish. I do this every year, I think. And it's, some of the things are probably all the same, but that's okay. I'm still thankful for them, even if I say them every year. I'm thankful for some really great friends that we have in our lives. I don't know. We're just really surrounded right now by some great godly influences, and it's just really special, and it means a lot to me. Oh, goodness. And I'm also thankful for all of you. Yeah, I was gonna say that. I'm thankful for our community. A lot of you guys have been in there since the beginning. Others of you have just joined in along the way. And it doesn't matter when or where you started watching us. Yeah, we're just so we're thankful, thankful for, you. for you guys and that you just sit there and you watch and you comment and you're part of our lives. Like we're so thankful and blessed by that. Absolutely. So thank you. Thank you for watching. Thank you so much. I think we're gonna end this and just go snuggle with our kitties. Yeah. Well, one kitty. I'm the tired. other kitty will not do any snuggling. No, you she know won't what? snuggle. It's an everyday struggle. That snuggle is an everyday struggle. <laughs> the lack of. The lack of the snuggle is an everyday <laughs> struggle. Hey, oh. I'm gonna get on a t-shirt. Oh, oh, speaking of this. Sneaking with snuggles. Look. Hello, snuggler. Oh, hello. <laughs> All right, well, we love you guys. Thank you so much for just everything and hope you've had a wonderful thanksgiving hope you've had a wonderful well, thanksgiving. hope you've had a wonderful thanksgiving yeah. it's probably been a few days past but and feel free if you want to leave a comment down below and just something that you're grateful for we'll talk to you guys soon we love you guys so much so much god, god bless, bless.